Hello everybody, it's Noel the Pop Hunter, and today we're going to be opening up one Beetlejuice soda. So let's get into it. So this is actually a really cool soda. I think I got this from Hot Topic, and we can just take it out of the wrap. So here it is. This is a brand new can. It could be a chase. I'm not sure what the chase is. I think it might be glow in the dark, but there it is on the can. There he is. Pretty cool soda. I do like Beetlejuice. And then there's the chase. You don't know what it is. But let's just open this up. I hope we get the chase for this one, because if it's glow in the dark, then that would definitely be cool. So this one, I'm gonna do the figure. Actually, that doesn't make sense if it's glow in the dark, but we can just open it up here. Okay, so is it a chase? Uh, I don't know. Either way, this is a really cool soda. It doesn't look glow in the dark, so I think it's the common. And... Common. So, this is still a pretty cool one. It's one in 12,500 Beetlejuice. There he is. This is actually a really great soda. I do like Funko sodas a lot. They're, they're making some really great ones recently. And especially this one. I know the ones that I want from that new wave are Batmite and definitely Energizer Bunny. I don't like the chase for the Energizer Bunny. That one's just weird. I don't even know what that came from. But, yeah, this is a really cool soda. An editor and I'll pop up a photo of the chase. I think it's glowing in the dark, and that would be pretty cool. And try to find a photo of it glowing. But, yeah, this is definitely one of the more detailed sodas. You can see, like, all of it is, uh, I don't know what it is. It's just kind of gross. But it's, like, uh, goo or something on his face all over there. And then his hair. I do like when Funko does, like, hair like that where it's all, like, spiky. Because then it just looks more, like, uh, realistic. And all the things on his face, they all are, like, actually in the sculpt. You can see all that on his head. And then his outfit's pretty cool, too, because it's all lined. And then his hand is all gooey, too. And, yeah, this is a really great figure. The Beetlejuice ones are really cool. And then he has a tie. And this is just a really great one. He has, like, a little beard, kind of. Not really a beard. But he's got some facial hair, and it's all, like, actually on the sculpt. So that is really awesome, and sodas are getting really great recently. And on this can, I don't know why they did black. I think it could have been, like, green and purple. I think that would have made a bit of sense. But I think the black looks nicer for, like, this part instead of being that green that he has, like, on his hair. But I think that would have definitely made sense. But now that I think of it, they did that for both of the Jokers. But this is a really cool one. I would like to get more sodas in the future. I think it's fun because, like, there's always a chance of a chase. I think there's, like, three that there isn't a chance of. And I'm probably not going to be getting those anytime soon. Except I do have one of them. But I'm not going to be opening that again because... It's already open. But I think soda videos can be more fun because they're like a mystery. And it's definitely more fun for me to film. But this is a really cool soda. And let me know if there's any other sodas that you think I should buy in the comment section below. And that's all for now. So make sure to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell if you want to see more by me. Goodbye.